Hello everybody, how's everyone there? Make a kick the desk. Alright. Again and again and again. For some reason localizer always have an issue and drama to talk about. So I am just gonna give my day one more time. And this time around, as much as I hate to put it out, I am gonna kinda like pull up the skill a little bit to justify it. Is the localizer uh justified on their action or are they just a whole new problematic people trying to do their job poorly and i say poorly it really means that they they have been very very uh bad in doing their job as a translator for animation so what you guys have to understand that localizer are actually people who, who translate words from other country to their own country language as well as uh, making it understandable for the local people to understand what the word which task the reason why it's called localizer and not translator that in, but at the end of the day it's still technically they are translator doing translation work all this thing along the line and that interestingly it always have a controversy with uh, japanese anime manga and games understand that the funny thing is right for japanese manga anime and games i talk about it a lot of time is that the translation even for me who teach others from uh how to like when i teach japanese people uh, japanese words or when i i, I mean Jap japanese people english word and english people japanese word like i do teach people all right and i know people will be like those who follow me for quite a long while throughout all my uh, uh my year as a vtuber they, a lot of people will be wondering like i mean how many jobs have you did in your whole life let me put up here for now i'm a jack of all trade and master of none so yeah um the thing is right it's actually very interesting to know that translation work I, which i had done also uh as a part-timer is that you tend to get a whole new list of words like they give you the japanese script and then you have to try to translate it to make it understandable for the local people to understand and often more than not right some of the japanese word when translating to english it's really not that easy because some of the words uh, can only be a pun in that language but not in the english so the only way to translate word to word uh, line by line is that sometimes you have to tweak it to make it understandable that keep the same meaning around there but at least the uh the joke will be like understandable for in when translated to another language so a lot of the often more than not is one of the hardest thing to do uh and it always like for me it's like it's it even uh when using like google translate at times right it's come out even funnier so often more than not i what i do is like i explain it in uh like the what it meant the whole sentence meant and then tell the joke around that but the way to translate word to words accordingly is very often very hard but um again the interesting part is that i was watching ref save death video and apparently just apparently that some localizer voiced their issue saying that uh trying to justify that people who are criticizing them uh are haters or entities of them but the thing is right people won't criticize you or people won't even hate you unless you're doing your job correctly and which is the reason why i say that they have been doing their job very very poorly uh ever since i have been talking about it the funny thing is right i did quite a few videos quite a lot more than this okay i just gonna show you like i saying like ai replacement good for fan and bad for localizer and voice actor like in a way because a lot of people are making noise about it uh all those localizer and voice actor are making about yeah, I'm going to replace them but a lot of fans are actually very very happy about it and at the same time shout out to Mr. Plum Pirate I know you actually want to say hi mate hi mate <laughs> yeah the one who when he actually make a AI video about localizer and then he put a jet in the video I was actually laughing when I was actually got this comment from him directly so yeah uh in regard is that I actually talk about how localizer coming out with reason to attack other people and it raised a few questions because the thing is right i talk about them being most of them are technically supposed to be expert in translation or maybe expert in doing this kind of job but one of the things that got raised in ref say that's video was that they actually like the person stated i can't recall where was the pacific point again uh oh yes there's no way for us a 
a pair of non expert to break down every single thing wrong with machine translation. So the thing is, right, when they say they are not, uh, there's no part as an expert, and they're saying try, they're trying to criticize that AI is not supposed to be uh trying, it's not supposed to represent uh represent human. I talk in my video all the time that AI is AI is meant as a tool. It's the reason why I actually talk about AI replacement because the thing is, right. Prom Pirate was able to do something that many people would not have realized is that you can use AI like he can't do the animation the voice acting or translation all these things himself he has to end up and also nice face uh, the thing is right uh, he has to use AI to do like as a tool to make the thing work it's still a tool it's something that you use the tools like if I have to give you a very and a very stupid example in daily life that you guys can un finally understand that AI is technically like a scissor and that the product is the instant noodle or maybe um, you want potato chip or whatsoever you if you are like you are just only make using the scissors to make your life easier by cutting the plastic bag so that you can open up the plastic and look into it imagine if most people who actually use their hand to force open up the packaging what does it come out most of the time when you use too much force or when you can't do, you don't have too much force either it doesn't open up or when it open up it bursts open and all the content spread all the, over the floor and then you start blaming no one by yourself so the thing is right at the end of the day i'm actually like just saying that ai is meant as a tool you are just only using the scissors to help you to cut up the packaging easily that's all and prone pirate was able to uh, uh prone pirate was able to do so with the video himself and the link is in the video description below so i will link it in uh you guys go and check this video or at the same time i'll put up the video in this video uh below so you guys can check check that out to understand what i meant the thing is right it it's really been uh, a thing that ai should meant to be meant as a tool but translate uh all the localizer and uh, voice are making noise about it and they're saying that they're not expert and i was like dude like and like seriously and when i was watching this video the first impression i was like dude if they are not expert, why not just use AI to translate it for them so that when they look at it, if there's something wrong with the sentence, they can change it a little bit. That's all you can need to do. So when they are stuck in making noise like AI replacing them or people criticizing them, it's that people are not very, very happy with the way a lot of anime got bashed by them or the words translation done by them. To the point that I actually talk about this, that uh, local like localizer situation is getting so worse that it's not even funny and in the video i talk along the line that Jap japanese people are not aware a lot of japanese people are again not very very happy about the situation where their favorite anime or manga or games are being mis so-called misrepresented to the western audience they're not very happy about it and the only one of the thing that the comment uh that they actually stated was that can we have the ai replace all those bad translator or localizer or voice actor again understand this thing only the bad one they didn't go around of saying along like oh uh we should remove all of them there are some people who believe in the goodness of the, some of the western people and they intend to keep it that way but if all the people i'm trying all the localizer and voice actors that are making noise on twitter right now are making so much to the point that if one day japan decided to go against like okay we're going to use it as the overall the western should not be crying at all because the thing is right if the, the only way in my opinion is that if localizer and all the good localizer and all the good translator understand what is wrong the best way they have to start defending all the anime fan like because a lot of there are a lot of uh, localizer and voice actor are attacking anime fan for the poor job they did so, oh uh and the thing is right it, a lot of people are being attacked uh or attacking around here there everywhere is that in my opinion i'm just like dude if the good lo localizer and translator are not stepping out to start making uh to under to point out what went wrong to those those co-workers they have been working with or people that is if if they are saying like oh they are, i'm a localizer or i'm a voice actor and they are not pinpointing the mistake that they are people who is in the same industry doing the uh is, are doing 
if in the future Japan decided to just use AI to overhaul all the Western translation, I don't think you guys uh, like everyone will be give uh to be making noise anymore because there is what they in the same what ref say that say you read what you saw. And personally, I do believe that um, the opinion uh, and the skill set against the localizer is that it's not against one localizer or two localizer. I'm still, even till now in all my video, I'm trying to uh, say that that specific person or that specific localizer or that specific voice actor. But I'm not going around saying that, oh, all the localizer and voice actors should be replaced. And then everyone will be able to do not the thing. I mean, like I wanted to be a voice actor back then, but then because I couldn't, so I and I'm not doing it. But the thing is, right, even for me, um, Voice acting is really not an easy job. I learned voice acting. Yes, I really seriously went to an anime studio in Japan and then learned the rule of anime vo uh, voice acting, okay? Um, I guess I got more fulfilling life than an average person now then. Uh, but the thing is, right, it really got a lot of uh, thinking from my side is that why would people go on the line of voice? Hey, what? you um. Because I did a very poor job, maybe I should start blaming everyone, or maybe I should start. The thing is, right, this is more on um human psychological thing that you guys have to understand. Um, in terms of trying to give them the benefit of doubt, right? Have you guys ever wondered like most people will not apologize for the mistake they made? They'll try to get a scapegoat, they're trying to push it to other people, and then they just justify that they are not the one to make the mistake. And in this case, localizer and voice actor are trying to push away the mistake or the thing they did to other people and in this case right now they are the one that is making a lot of noise are the anime fan so it really do pay me off a little bit but it really is uh like interesting to see like how some of the localizer or voice actor are trying to justify their reasoning and it's very very weird like when when they start losing or when they don't have facts to justify their reason they tend to pull out reason for out of nowhere out of the abyss or out of the black hole or whatever places that you can dig out or maybe uh the the water under the toilet bowl is that they will come up with weird reasoning to justify the mistake they did and it amazed me in so many ways that how can it like able to get this job in the first place and most of them you have uh you have to understand that i have been vocal about it is that most of them are uh, university certified which means that they are supposed to be considered smart people and if they are not smart in doing their job then the question i would have to ask is that what are they are certified on is is it a fake certified or is it a f real degree false degree which one i do not know but the thing is right it, at, at the end of the day it really got a lot of people questioning like the legitimacy of their work and how seriously are they doing their job it's like it's, they are doing a from how i look at looking at it it's like a very very poor job no matter how you they try to spin it it's really really bad and i'm not saying that all of them are bad there are some who are very very good at doing the translation and i intend to say that uh ai should be used by a, as a tool but those people uh, those localizer or voice actors that are making a lot of noise right now are actually being so vocal so making such a huge noise on twitter or any other where uh or any other platform is that they are painting not just themselves as badly they are just as well as painting all the general uh, general localizer and voice actor badly you know not the Japanese one, the Japanese one can stay one side. But the thing is, right, is imagine that all the, um, when all the voice actor or all the localizer on the Western side start making noise about it, and then they say, oh, we as a representative of all localizer and all voice actor, yeah, that is when the things start going south already, okay, guys? Because the thing is, right, when that actually happened, people are going to be even more mad. And then those people who is not on the, like, those people who is out of nowhere got targeted or not even involved in those kind of things because they don't want to yeah they're all gonna get general as one and then people start making noise and then next time in future when every game is being used ai's no voice actor no whatsoever yeah that's gonna be a whole new a whole new story in uh for future for future random chat but the thing is right it's gonna get uh, even more worse and right now it's very 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 worse from how i look at it it's really so crazy that you have finally reached the stage that I've been waiting for. Which basically waiting for them to give the weirdest 
reasoning to justify their mistake. So the thing is, right, overall, I'm actually very, uh, like, you guys have to understand, in terms of argument, right, when a side is losing, the, again, they will come up with the weirdest reason, uh, the weirdest thing, and they will try to push the brain to other people or to just try to justify their mistake or their, uh, their action or this thing. Is that it amazed me on so many ends that how can they uh, be so deep skin Like, in, the word deep skin is really one of the stronger things that I always feel like is uh, amazed me in so, so many ends. Because if you guys know the seven scene uh, in many other on many other culture right pride is always one of the best one because it, pride can actually represent deep skin and how deep skin are all uh, those people can be so if you go and check uh, some of my video i'll put all the video for this issue even twitter giving weird reason again to attack manga or anime or even like localizer attacking amos girl in a tiktok video raise a few questions right it's like it amaze me if you guys think about it uh if you think, think about it right is that it amazed me that how thick skin those people can be by just trying to justify them and the reason tend to be very very weird this time around uh the i wasn't supposed to be, uh, I, I didn't want to talk about this but because it had finally reached that part of weird reasoning now i decided to talk about it and just give a, a quick take over it but anyway uh i think that should be enough for now uh i, I cover quite this case a lot of time you guys can check the um all the previous video on how i talk about it all of the link will be on the description below so you guys can check them out but if you guys got want to check uh talk more about it or you got you got your own taste your own opinion your own subject uh stuff that you think about those uh this story, uh situation right now write in the comment below and we can discuss this further but if you do like this kind of uh if you do like this video don't forget to press the like button and subscribe for more random chat where i talk chat about stuff that never follow a single trend but till then hope you guys have a nice day all night bye